Okay, now let's move to the menu recipe editor. Now you saw just a few seconds ago, we pulled some items into inventory, we received them, we had, you know, created a purchase order, received them, pulled them into inventory. And now what we're gonna do is we're gonna go to setup, inventory setup, menu recipe editor. And under that menu recipe editor, we're gonna be able to, under one menu item, create all the ingredients that you can extract from inventory so you can have an appropriate inventory level. So let's look at this. So we have everything here. Um, what, what basically we need to do, this, this will help out a lot, is let's choose an item. Now, granted, we, we had already purchased uh, all the inventory items for this item, so this is what we're gonna do, is we're gonna at start attaching ingredients to this item. So let's look at the chicken breast random, and we're actually going to use one chicken breast going to add that. Now let's add the lettuce. And we're actually going to use a tenth of that piece of lettuce. We're going to add that. Now let's add the tomato. Units used, 0.1 again. And uh, granted, all these ingredients are going to be different. You just need to be, be careful to um, really take your unit of measure that you're using for your business and, and with, with the packs that you purchased to be really careful to do that. So let's add this one last item. We'll add the croissant. And we'll just have one croissant. So we have this entire thing right here. Now, if you, if you want to talk about mayonnaise and you talk about all these other things, you definitely can attach those as well. I just wanted you to see this entire thing. Now, the reason I wanted you to see the pricing on all this is we pulled all those items in from a purchase order, received them into inventory and purchased them. And look at this. You see your recipe cost right here. You have your minimum retail, which is right here, and your current retail, which is what you're charging. So you can really keep a, a very, um, tight grip on your margins and on your pricing here and you can update the price so that that's that um, recipe cost average that we were talking earlier so new items that you've pulled in inventory because you're going to create this one time okay you're going to create this now you may edit the sandwich however many times you want but you're going to create this one time but the amount of, of time that you uh, the amount of cost, rather, that you have within a specific ingredient is going to appear here. You just need to update the price from time to time by pressing this button, update price. This minimum retail, um, that is, that's just the minimum that you need to really maintain the margin that we have set default in the system. And then current retail is $9.95 as we discussed. So you can see that we've got this recipe editor right here. and We could sell a sandwich and it would deplete these specific amounts from inventory. So that's a pretty comprehensive approach to reducing inventory with the menu recipe editor.